Right, good morning guys. The time is nearly 5 a.m. I think it's about 4.30 actually. You're not gonna believe it. I'm going back to Monaco, which I'm so excited about. After last week, I know what I'm getting into. So yeah, I can't wait. L'Oreal are taking us. We're gonna be flying out, going to experience the Grand Prix. We're gonna be doing some water sports. A possibility of meeting Lewis Hamilton and having a quick chat with him. Should be really, really fun. Yeah, just uh, the itinerary looks insane. I can't wait. <laughs> So we've just been changed into some smart clothes and we're heading to the helipad now to catch the helicopter to the apartment. We have full squad, Mr. Marcus Butler. I love how you're like, we've just been changed as if Robin James, as if someone has we've changed us. Changed. Charlotte Jones. <laughs> Charlotte Jones. Hey, Adrian up front looking all dapper. Due to the streets being closed here in Monaco for the Grand Prix, we're actually walking to the venue where we will be watching the race. And it's raining. Can't believe it's raining, but it'll make for a more interesting race, apparently, because they can overtake in the pit stops. So all is good. Oh, I think I'm talking about it. So we have just come back to the apartment in Monaco and the hotel is actually beautiful. Um, check out how nice this view is here, look. see behind us and um, loads of yachts and there's a big huge mountain up there so yeah it's uh, really nice to come back to. The Grand Prix was amazing, Lewis Hamilton smashed it, it's going to be really nice because tomorrow we are due to um, have a little chat with Lewis and just talk about the race but also talk about you know fitness, fashion, male grooming bits, it's not all going to be Formula One, uh, it's going to be quite a lifestyle sort of casual chat so I'm really looking forward to that because hopefully he'll be in a good mood. I can't express to you how good the Grand Prix was, like we had the most incredible view. We were at the Monaco apartment and you could see like half the track. There was like two legs that you could watch. Um, you could see the pit stops. You had the view of the port. 
all of the stands were visible and there was amazing food and drink on tap. Uh, L'Oreal put on such a display, it was so, so good. So thanks guys for today. Oh yeah, the helicopter ride. I forgot to mention about the helicopter ride. So uh, obviously I caught some content of that. So we did go on a helicopter where we arrived to the F1, which was so James Bond. I feel like helicopters are becoming a regular occurrence. They're so cool. Every time I get in one, it's just like, it feels amazing to be in them. That's the way they like take off, like whew. So yeah, that was wicked. And I'm gonna have a bit of a chill out. I'm gonna have a shower, get ready, because this evening we have the after party for the Grand Prix, which is at Amber Bar. But before that, we're gonna go for a cocktail at the rooftop bar, which is in the hotel. So yeah, I'm gonna chill out for a bit. Take five, enjoy your massage and get ready for this evening. Earlier on today, L'Oreal gave us this waterproof adventure bag because tomorrow we're gonna to be doing jet skiing. Really looking forward to that. So they gave us this bag and then inside this bag, they gave us some more L'Oreal product, which is lovely. This is the moisturizer. This is a deodorant and they've given us a pair of sunglasses, even though it's not been too sunny recently in Monte Carlo. And then these were the binoculars that we used today for the Grand Prix. They're actually really good. It's quite impressive. And then some flyer information. This shocked me. They give us some Vilbequin swim shorts. That is amazing. I've wanted these for so long and they've got them in such a cool colour and I know people be like it's just black but trust me black is classy and I'm happy about these. Happy. Also there is this case full of their product. Um, don't know how I'm going to quite get this home because that case is massive. I can't wait to try all this stuff out. They're deodorants, these are showers. These are moisturizers, deodorants, and this is aftershave, this is face wash, and these are both shampoo, conditioner, multifunctional shower kit. Thank you so much for all of this lovely product. It's gonna to go to a good use. Okay, I'm not quite sure when this is gonna end. I've just came into the bathroom and there's a load more L'Oreal product. And then I turn left onto the bath and there's a load more L'Oreal product. I don't know how we're gonna get all this home. This is so, so generous. We are very, very spoiled. Good evening, guys. So I have had a lovely massage, really chilled out and got showered. I'm now in my smart attire for this evening. Um, I've gone with like a really light and clean blazer. I've got my new Hermes little handkerchief in here. I'm wearing a nice, fresh, crisp white shirt. I have some black trousers on, which have been fitted at the bottom. Got some shoes on. And I have a mulberry belt. Yeah, that's my attire this evening. Um, I'm accessorizing with a ring and my Longies watch. So yeah, um, really looking forward to tonight. Um, this is the official after party for the Grand Prix. Really looking forward to getting some food inside me and having a good old party. We'll get going. Catch you guys in a sec. food um, then we went to the amber bar and it pretty much went from zero to 100 pretty quick <laughs> and a really good night um, maybe slightly overslept this morning so i'm just packing up my bits now because we're going to be heading to the jet skis um, we're going to be doing some fly boarding which is the jet packs we're going to be spending some time on the yacht so i better get a crack on and we'll see you guys soon hey guys so just finished off having some breakfast and there's still quite a few stragglers from last night that haven't turned up so I think we're just going to wait for everybody to come down. Then we're going to have a little talk about the L'Oreal products. So looking forward to today, it's going to be so cool. Um, I'm feeling better now, I've had some food in me. I was feeling a little bit ropey this morning. But yeah, I do feel a lot better now, which is all good.
So we're just on our way to the jet skis now. We've got the boy, Magic Fox. <laughs> So here we have Robin James and Marcus Butler unable to ride a jet ski competently for more than 20 seconds. Too funny. Hi guys, so we're joined with Lewis Hamilton and we're going to be answering five quick questions. Let's go. So I'm a huge animal lover. Me too. And I know I found Roscoe loves Coco. Yeah. yeah oh no way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I, I thought that I was crazy because I have an animal account for my cat. And that's all you yeah. so like, okay, You've got to be a cat. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. I love animals. So my question is, how do you cope being away without them? <laughs> so being away from Roscoe and Coco, it, it's hard. It's like, they're like my kids, you know. Um, but my sister looks after them. It's always sending me snaps of what they're getting up to. Yeah, I wish they were here. Yeah, I wanted you, to do you run that account or? Huh? Do you run the account? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Cool. But I haven't had any really good pictures of them, of them recently. So. <laughs> I haven't seen them for took away, like three weeks. Probably. Yeah, they travel with me mostly. But it's hard work. Um, like Monaco, it's hard work having them in Monaco. There's not a lot of grass. It's not really yeah. great places to water them. Yeah. Yeah. And um, they don't allow you on the beach. I want to bring her to a fashion show. I need to bring her to a fashion sure. show, like, but done, like, with, with an outfit for the fashion show and then have her sit. Give <laughs> 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 you be so funny. Get your plus one. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, next question is being active is hard on your skin. How do you combat that? Inactive is definitely tough on your skin, but I try my hardest to keep it looking fresh. Um, I anti-fatigue, moisturize every single day, several times. Inactive is definitely tough on your skin. Yeah, honestly, I moisturize a lot. So yeah. skin gets super dry. Gonna be a casual hair agreement. Oh, 
Well, I just basically said it's the anti fatigue. Do I say L'Oreal anti fatigue or? You say Men Expert anti fatigue. Men Expert anti fatigue. Not L'Oreal. Men expert, L'Oréal men expert, men expert. In French, L'Oréal. Yeah, I love. So my hero product is um, Men Expert anti fatigue. That's the really cute mark. Me looking young, even though I'm kind of getting old. Do you like hearing yourself back? No, I hate hearing myself. I don't think anyone likes hearing. I, I like my, I like hearing my music. My singing voice is different to my talking voice. Yeah. So yeah. I like I like That's listening to my songs. That's true for a lot of people actually. But I don't like listening to myself talking in interviews. Or really? Yeah, it's yeah. really really weird. Mm. It's the same for everyone, isn't it? No yeah. one likes to hear yeah. themselves. Yeah. But musically, I like. I'm not used to I like hearing interviews. So. <laughs> we played my music in the club last night. Really? Yeah, we played two songs. Oh my God, cool. It's because everyone's dancing, which is kind of cool. <laughs> what did Justin think? Yeah, he said we've got to do something together. Oh, cool. I'm like. Oh, this is great. So, fitness. Fitness, yeah. so fitness is a big part of your life. How do you stay on track? Certain, like, make, when you're traveling and stuff. Yeah. Like, like at home, it's quite easy, but when you're traveling, yeah. so it's hard. So, fitness, the, the great thing with fitness is you can do it anywhere. So, um, first thing I do when I wake up 100 press ups, um, you know, like a couple hundred sit ups, um, just fit them in anywhere. Is that enough of an answer? Or? Yeah, I think that's a good yeah. answer. Yeah, yeah. I, I do go to the gym, but I, I I don't like being confined in one space. No, no, no. So yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of sometimes we go running or we, we bike ride to the top of the mountain here and then we get a tree and we do TRX off the tree. Yeah. Or something, you know. Do you take your own TRX? Yeah. 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 So good. Well, my, my trainer brings me around, but yeah. I like doing stuff outside with my own body weight. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There's just so much to see. I, I never ride a, I never, I'm never on an indoor bike and I'm never on a, a treadmill. I go crazy. Yeah. 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 I, to be honest, I've been doing sparring. Boxing, yeah, boxing bags. I like, I do, actually, I, I like boxing. Yeah, boxing is really good fun. But I was sort of like stress for you as well. Yeah, especially when you can take a lot out of yeah, it. Yeah, just yeah. Back, back, back. Mm. That answer leads me on nicely to last question. Yeah. Do you want to press up competition? Press up con competition. Look at my arms straight arms. away. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> the the arms. arms. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> And you press up today, he said, so no. he's gonna smash oh, this. Shoot. I think 40 is my record. 40 is your record? Yeah, I don't, I don't agree. No, you're bringing a line. I'm not doing it. It's a line. Okay, well, I don't mind doing it. Yeah? Yeah, I need a bit of workout today anyway. Right, ready? Yeah. Yeah? Ready? He's just a born champion. That was a good job, that man. Oh. Damn! Why wow. did I do that? Uh, Your turn. Once a winner, always a winner. I'm gonna suppress You can do ten. You can do ten. Yeah. Yeah. No, we're not. Not now. <laughs> <laughs> not now. So that's it, we are Woo. pooped. Lewis won. Damn. Not really that much. 
I think you let me win. <laughs> See the size of these guys are. So that was the interview done with Lewis Hamilton. Um, the first person I've ever interviewed. And it was sort of like a different style of interview. It wasn't like formal, it was really relaxed. And obviously it was a Snapchat takeover. But the first person to ever interview me, Lewis Hamilton, is just crazy. So happy that L'Oreal gave me that chance to do that. And Robin James is coming in the background very seamlessly. Hey there. <laughs> it was an um, incredible experience. And I feel very lucky to have had the opportunity to have done that. We're just going to chill now on the boat. Um, I think our flight is later on this evening. So I just going to chill out, relax, and enjoy the beautiful views of the Love is So I'll call, but we know I'll see you down the line And we'll hate what we've lost, but we'll love what we find And I hope I'm feeling fine, we made it to the coastline So guys, that is it. My trip to Monaco has come to an end and it was absolutely amazing. It was so good. So I'm gonna go home, get some well-earned rest and get ready for work next week. So yeah, until the next one, see you later guys.